Hey guys, Mr. Yojo One here. Uh, bringing you a video review. This time it's my Iron Man 2 movie series, Ironmonger. Now, Ironmonger, as you know, is the uh, one from the first one. Now, I've been looking for this figure in a while, and this figure's a no-brainer, guys. You see this guy? Pick him up. He's just absolutely amazing. He's big, yes, but he is just freaking awesome. Uh, now, he is really large. Uh, compared to some of the other three and three quarter inch figures, uh, let me get to what he has. He has his gallon gun, which is right here. Uh, I'm gonna want to say it's a flamethrower. He's got his little jetpack things, and he's got a bluish tint. I don't think he had a bluish tint in the movie. I thought he was more of a just a grayish myself. Let's get him out of the picture real quick. Because of his three armor cards. You know, base, they all come with the same base. But here's Ironmonger himself. Now his knees bend uh, ever so slightly. He's got these little rubber latex things here. But, guys, this is just an, oh my god, amazing figure. Pick this guy up if you see him. I mean, he is awesome. Now, this is him. Uh, his size. This is the, supposed to be the three and three quarter. But I think he's like six inches. I haven't measured him. But I think he's like. There we go. I think he's like six inches or something. But here he is compared to the uh, Mark II. As you can see, there's a big size difference. But oddly enough to say, it's not accurate. Because the six scale figure would be up to scale with these guys, because Iron Monger was huge compared to Iron Man, as you know. So, uh, different size comparison. So, uh, he's got, you know, he had an RPG in the movie, you know, and this all lifted up, but this is Mr. Yojo 1, and I'm going to go ahead and end this review on a quick note. Buy this figure. If you see it, just buy it. So, this is Mr. Yojo 1 saying, until next time, guys, this I figure it's an 8.5 out of 10, because he's big, and that's pretty much it, and uh, there's a few paint defects, but how can you mess up, alright, so this is Mr. Joe one giving this an 8.5, and, and I'll see you soon, YouTube.